about aliens. There's aliens all over our universe. My guides told me that there were over 600 billion aliens in the universe. They're everywhere. There's aliens here on Earth. There, there's aliens on other planets around us. They're everywhere. And the fact that we don't know about this is really simple. Humanity has had amnesia for a long time. If we could remember where we come from and where we originated, it wouldn't be such a big mystery. There's people all over the world that have seen UFOs, have had experiences of seeing aliens, have had experiences of being abducted. Some of those experiences are tough and they're not fun. And yes, the duality exists throughout the universe. There's good and there's bad all over. So there's higher consciousness, higher evolved alien beings, and there's lower consciousness and lower evolved alien beings. We just have to figure out how to keep our vibration really high so that we're attracting the Pleiadians. We're attracting higher energies like the angelic force. You know, angels are as real as the rest of them. It's just understanding that most alien beings like us travel in spirit form. That's our natural state of being is in spirit form. That's their natural state of being. So not everybody gets a body. We're really lucky. We're really lucky that we have physical form. And there are some aliens who would like to have our physical form. There are aliens that actually try to inhabit our bodies. And there's aliens who have, you know, created hybrids of humans and their form. It's nothing to be afraid of. It's simply having the facts and knowing what to be aware of and what you're looking for and what you're looking out for. So be careful that you know who you're talking to and what you're doing when you're in a place like I am right now. I'm in the middle of this big portal where there's a lot of activity and a lot of things that come through and a lot of energy that leaves the earth. And be aware of your surroundings. Feel what you're feeling. This is one of the biggest things that humanity has sort of flicked the switch on. I don't feel it anymore. I'm not feeling anything. I don't, I don't feel. Well, it's time we get back to that. And that's being close to her. That's being able to feel the earth beneath you, to ground in her and to be alive on her and not asleep at the wheel because someone else is going to do it for you or somehow it's going to get served up to you. Be here now, it's a good saying, and really be present with who's in front of you and who's talking to you. You might notice some things you haven't. 